Good evening. And good evening and welcome to Out of the Bag. This is Sean Maguire live on People's Internet Radio. That's www.peoplesinternetradio.com where we are seeking solutions. And tonight I really needed to have a solution to what is going on in my uh, in my uh, show tonight. So um, without further ado, I'm going to invite and uh, hopefully he's with me now. I'm going to have Freeman Jack with me for the first hour. Uh, Jack, are you with me? Good evening, Sean. I most certainly am. And good evening, people. <laughs> Fantastic to have you back on Out of the Bag. So, Jack, tonight um, I was looking at your, uh, is it called Omni- Omniversity? <laughs> Open Omniversity. Open Omniversity YouTube channel. I want everybody to check that out, please. Um, I'll put the link in uh, as soon as I've got a moment to uh, drag, it, drag it across. Brilliant, brilliant. Um, it's uh, associated with my old uh, Freeman Jack channel, and I will still be uh, uploading any of my uh, primary work like this uh, to that channel, so people can still expect to hear anything that I produce personally yeah. um, on my main channel. Uh, but the basic premise behind the Open Omniversity, I used to be a huge fan of the uh, BBC Two late night <laughs> Open University uh, broadcasts. I used uh, to listen being to the an enormous mice. insomniac, having something to watch between the hours of midnight and sort of six a.m. was an absolute lifesaver for me in my sort of uh, childhood and early teens. Jack, believe it or not, I used to sit and listen up to, to the Open University as well. Mm, uh, uh, and it was fa- it was fabulous cure for insomnia, <laughs> especially <laughs> sociology one hundred and one. <laughs> oh, but anyway, I, di- I diverse, I digress. Yes. Uh, but having uh, acquired a bit of an aversion now to the university system and its habit of narrowing the field of inquiry rather than broadening it which to my mind is the very nature of science and scientific inquiry itself. Uh, I began toying with the concept of omniversity um, some time ago. I, I sort of rattled around a few terms, but that one finally kind of, I finally settled on that one. And for me, uh, I'm hoping to supply a resource from uh, sort of cradle to the grave of reliable vetted material which simply does what it says on the tin so there will be playlist categories of as many major categories as i can find supporting material for or create the supporting material for and i will try my very best to populate the the channel with videos that you could put on with anybody in the room and not be ridiculed or you know what I mean <laughs> find that anybody would have any primary problem with the issue with the manner in which the information is being disseminated so basically I want it to be a, a go to resource for uh the the internet media that's available yeah it sounds fantastic i mean you have been asking many hosts including myself um, to try and, uh, you know, pass on to you shows and uh, various conversations we've had online that, that, that might be useful to that channel. Well, and moreover, uh, being that it's not my personal channel and the, the nature in which I've set it up is through the YouTube um, facility for businesses, mm-hmm. uh, unlike a personal channel, it does have the facility for having more than one administrator. So if anybody is a particular devotee of YouTube and who, like me, feels that it's a miasma of uh, mainly um, uh, not reliable source material and feel the desire, like me, to accumulate a resource of uh, reliable sort of go-to material on any subject and feels the, the... uh, desire to do so with me then please get in touch and uh, I can open up admin channels for you so that you can join me in not only uh, adding play- adding to playlists but if you're up for creating your own material then uh, having a, a, a established channel through which to do that uh, one of the things that I will beg and plead with the listeners of PIR to do is please subscribe 
um, just simply because the number of subscribers that a channel, any given channel has, determines its rankings yeah. when it comes to populating recommended videos. Well, I, I sc- and, subscribe today, um, and thank you. I, I really and do it's obviously it. with opening up this new channel, I'm essentially leaving behind a very established channel with now uh, approaching eighty thousand hits, I think, and. Uh, nearly 500 subscribers so it's a big leap into the sort of dark for me with this so I'd be very obliged if as many people could possibly sort of support me on this endeavour and whether it sort of sinks or swims we shall see but um, it's certainly an endeavour that I'll be putting a lot of time and effort into and uh, all of that time and effort would obviously be wasted if uh, if it doesn't get promoted through the, the sort of YouTube algorithms Absolutely, and any updates you want us to promote here on PIR, we, we certainly will. Well, and this is another point as well. Although it's called Open Omniversity, the reason why I selected that particularly sort of um, uh, ambiguous uh, title was because of the issues that we've had with the radio station and name changes in the past. Yes. Uh, I wanted it essentially to be a people's internet radio uh, YouTube channel specifically mm-hmm. so uh, it will be where I upload as many PIR broadcasts as possible to and provide links to as many that I find elsewhere on uh, on YouTube so again it will also be the place to go for PIR listeners who are wanting to catch up on old shows or who are perhaps wanting the the specifics like the solutions based stuff that Vin does or etc cetera, etc cetera. No, and I'll do my best to populate each playlist so that these are in a, a, a semblance of order so that you'll be able to browse through playlists perhaps in alphabetical order or whatever so that you'll actually be able to find the stuff that you want to look for brilliant <clears throat> that sounds brilliant but we're, we're going to move on now now actually um, Nick has put the link into the chat room um, oh thank you Nick you're a star as so, usual <laughs> so we can so we can share that obviously but it's one of those it's going to be difficult to read out um yes no i would i mean it's it'll be if people simply uh put open omniversity uh channel into their youtube search bar it will come up as the the only link brilliant so, brilliant fortunately it's a name that there, i think there's one other um i think it's actually one of your guests um Oh, le, uh, le, Al- uh, le, well, Le Webmont or whatever yes, his name is. Yes, Al- um, Alfred, Alfred Weber, yeah. I think he has a, a an Omniversity YouTube channel <laughs> as well. <laughs> well, his book yeah. the, is all about the Omniversity. It's not Open Omniversity, it's something else. But he's, I think he's the only other one that's used that particular term. Okay, and just to uh, tell I the listeners... there's a, a tech group up in, up in Birmingham that may have used it a few years ago as well, but they seem to have petered away, so... Okay, well, just to tell the listeners, uh, Jack, that uh, <clears throat> I will be putting the, um, the, the, uh, the link also into the podcast page for this for this show so the link okay, will be available, fabulous. Thank you. available there as well okay well i mean and specifically the the subject the material that we're going to move on to tonight uh the one of the reasons for one of my sort of driving reasons for wanting to create the new youtube channel was simply that um i have become reliant on uh on my youtube subscriptions mm. on having a a, a a database now of subscriptions of reliable sources of information. So I know that the people who upload videos to those channels, generally speaking, those videos will be of merit and worth a look. Yes. As a consequence, my recommended YouTubes on, uh, uh, my recommended videos on my YouTube channel, uh, often spring forth items.